Hey, what's up, guys? Mr. Lee Gaming here, bringing you a quick update on Call of Duty Black Ops 3 Zombies. Okay, so here is some fixes they did during this patch that they just released on February 8th, 2016. I'll be telling you this in a second. So, okay, so this is this applies for both PlayStation 4 and Xbox One. Of course, you know, the updates always differ from system to system, but this time, this one actually carries over to both. This one is re uh, revolving around the Shadows of Evil Easter egg. There was a apparently there was a bug during the main Easter egg step where if you if it bugged out you couldn't complete your Easter egg. Now they fixed that they resolved that. So now hopefully people can now complete their their Shadows of Evil Easter egg without it like bugging out on them. Okay, so now this, this one's more for PS4. This is for Dreisendraha. It's the new map for uh, Call of Duty, the Awakening from the Awakening DLC. They actually fixed the gravity spikes. Uh, I'm not sure if you guys know this, but there's there's a glitch with the gravity spikes where zombies can walk through your little force field or your gravity uh, force. When you put it down, they can go, go through, hit you, and probably kill you. They now fix that, so when the zombies enter your little uh, gravity spike field, it will, it should kill them instantly. Uh, another thing they fixed was the the killing time glitch uh, for the main Easter egg step. So if you had killing time during the boss fight with the keeper. You would actually probably you would actually bug out your game, causing it to crash. So they fixed that. There's still some other uh, bugs that they need to fix during the, for the main Easter egg, but I'm glad they got that one done. So you can now use killing time with the main Easter egg uh, since they fixed that bug. Okay, now here's some sad news. They actually removed some stuff from the game. Okay, so what they removed is actually two gobble gums from the game. Uh, one of them is unquenchable, and then the other one I don't know the name of, but I'll tell you exactly what it did. Okay, so this gobble gum, if you had it and used it, it allowed you to, it, it gave you an instant pack a punch weapon from the wall. So let's say if you buy the Vesper for 1250, that would now be a pack a punch Vesper that you have because of that gobble gum. They removed that gobble gum from the game, plus unquenchable, which makes me kind of sad. I kind of use the uh, wall pack a punch uh, one quite a bit. Kind of sad to see it go. Uh, I, gu I guess they do have another gobble gum that kind of resembles it, so I can understand why they did that. Unquenchable too. So I don't know how you guys feel about that, but those two, as of right now, are removed from the game, as you can see from the picture right here. Uh, you can see this on both Xbox and PlayStation if you want to see it for yourself. Of course, there'll be a link to this, uh, link in the description below to both PlayStation 4 and Xbox One patch notes, so you can go check that out for yourself. Of course, the Gobble Gum will not be in the patch notes itself, so, so far they're not included but I'm pretty sure they'll add them in later on. But if you found this video helpful, if you got some good information on this video, give this video a like, subscribe if you're new to the channel, and I hope to catch you guys next time.